Hi guys, today in this video we are going to look at the Lewis structure for O3 molecule. It's a chemical formula for ozone and it is made up of three oxygen molecule atoms. To understand the Lewis structure for this molecule, we will first check the total number of valence electrons. So here oxygen has six valence electrons and as there are three oxygen atoms, we are going to multiply this number by three. In total, we have 18 valence electrons for O3. So as there are no difference of electronegativities between these atoms, we are going to place all the three atoms like this and we will place two valence electrons between these two uh, oxygen atoms to show a chemical bond and this will be the same for this side as well. Now we have used four valence electrons out of 16 and we will place the other valence electrons around oxygen atoms. So uh, although we have used 16 valence electrons here, the octet for the central atom is not complete and the oxygen atoms on the sides have a complete octet. But if you know the uh, rules for Lewis structure, the central atom should have a complete octet. So what we will do is we will shift these two electrons from this oxygen atom here and we will form a double bond here which means that now the octet for both these oxygen atoms will be complete. Now these, this bond can be on this side as well and a molecule that shows these kind of structures is known as resonance structures. The structure of uh, ozone is unique as a central atom has a one double bond and one single bond with its neighboring oxygen molecule uh, atoms. These bonds keep interchanging their places and hence this ozone molecule has resonant Lewis structure. So there are this uh, resonance Lewis structures of O3 in which either of uh, these oxygen atoms have a double bond and the structures are shown like this. So this is the Lewis structure for O3 and for more videos on Lewis structure, polarity, molecular geometry of the molecule, subscribe to our channel and thank you for watching.